Hey guys, beautiful day we're having today. Nice Friday. Outside messing with some sidewalk chalk. And we're also messing with our garden. I'll show you a little bit of that right now. Say hi. hi. Doing some sidewalk chalk. Can you that? Yeah. yeah. You having fun? Huh? Fun. Beautiful sunny day today. ABC. ABC, she says. And we actually transplanted a few things. Right here next to me, I've got my... Wind's been blowing a little bit. I think they called it fiery dragon's breath. Dragon. Or just dragon's breath. One of the two. But I transplanted that today. Oops. Yeah, it's so many leaves in there. Put it in one of these self-watering. I love these pots like this on the bottom. So I don't have to worry about it too much. And then I also transplanted one of these guys here. So many leaves in there. Also in one of the self-watering things as well. I just cannot get enough of those. I think they work out really well, especially for these ones sitting beside my stairs here. I don't remember exactly what these guys were called, but their flowers are just amazing. Amazing, she says. Amazing. So I have some topsoil in there. I also have some black mulch and then some um, miracle Grow. I forgot what the type it was, but it has like fish eggs and stuff in it for pro-growth and stuff. And also, we got really lucky, and from one of our cups here, just the regular ones, I end up having another flower. Or I'm sure um, it's a plant. A vegetable plant of some sort. I'm going to maybe say bell pepper or tomato. But yeah, that's exciting. And so inside this pot here, I actually um, have some cloned roses. Ended up snipping off some of the rose here and um, put some gel on the bottom of it. Cloning gel. And it um, actually is working out really well. We had a little bit of rose on there the other day. And then I snipped off the dead ones. And it appears that we do have some more budding right now and growing back. Little guy. Also inside there is some topsoil as well. Some black mulch. And as well as that miracle grow that I was telling you about. Appears to be doing very well as long as you keep them trimmed up. Once they start to die off, of course, you gotta cut off the dead ends there. So they promote growth and come back. Like these guys right here, he's gonna be so pretty. And then we have my tomato plant right here, which is the yellow pear. It has more than quadrupled its size within the past two weeks. And then back in the back there, we have our onions. And as you can see, I left it so, so that I didn't take it out of the video. I have some mushrooms growing in here that I'm going to have to cultivate. They um, popped up on me pretty quick there. Best to take care of them as soon as possible so they don't destroy the rest of my garden. We also have those chives that are just growing really good there. Really impressed actually with the whole garden itself, how it's turning out. And then over here we have our kale, which is doing very good. My chocolate mint. Our beautiful purple heart succulent. Now these guys are doing extremely well. These are for our bearded dragons. We have two bearded dragons and they love this kale. So this worked out actually pretty well.
And then the mint, the mint is doing exceptional. I cut it off not too long ago, about to right here, and it's at least grown that much within about a month. You having fun? Fun. Yeah. We painting. Painting. Okay, so we got our chicken in the oven. We did some shake and bake. Shake and bake. Some chicken breast. And uh, it was ranch. Ranch flavored shake and bake. It sure was, yeah. Bowtie noodles are bubbling. They're boiling goo. Yeah, she said she's excited. Making some Alfredo. You can see as we do it, it starts to get all shiny. That shine obviously, you know, kind of keeps them from sticking to each other a little bit. And obviously gives them some nice, delicious flavor. Yum. Yum. Okay, so our chicken is just about done. It's getting there. Smells delicious. I wish we had some smell of vision so you guys could smell this. Nom, 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 nom. Alrighty, I also did up some veggies. I boiled up some broccoli, some cauliflower, and some carrots. Yum, 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 yum. Then I seasoned it with salt, pepper, and just a little bit of fresh garlic and some butter. Delicious. I like to get it nice and soft. Nobody wants to bite into a hard carrot, hard cauliflower. No, no thank you. We like it nice and soft. There we go, yeah. Delicious. All right, perfect. Chicken is nice and done. Let's see if I can't get in there while we're filming. Yeah, look at that. Chicken. That's what it does when you open it like that. It stinks, it goes, the chicken. And we're done. Delicious. So we have the bow tie pasta with our Alfredo sauce. And then I made the chicken breast and then breaded it with the shake and bake. And we got our delicious veggies on the side. All right, guys. Nom, nom, nom.